the summer of 1941 saw the RAF take the war to Hitler as British fighters and bombers swept into German-occupied territory, taunting the Luftwaffe into combat. On August the 9th of that year, Douglas Bader, the famed British pilot with two tin artificial legs, commanded such an offensive sweep into France. A mission which would see his Spitfire destroyed and bring him face to face with another legend, German ace Adolf Galland. In part three of Aero Cinema's exclusive series, Galland gives a first-hand account of the events leading to Bader's capture. He wanted to see the German fighter pilot who had shot him down. I see. <laughs> we didn't know this exactly. Maybe I have done it. I shot down two Spitfires on this mission. Now a prisoner of war, Bader received a special invitation from his German counterpart and a private demonstration of a key piece of the Luftwaffe arsenal. He said, could you please start the engine? Yes, I want to make only a little flight around the place here. <laughs> only around this place. I said, no. I would have to step in my second 109 and to shoot the town again. Discover how Bader's daring and determination made him an almost impossible man to gauge. He didn't know where he was. He was gone. He didn't have the French girl. He didn't have Bader. And my situation was not very pleasant at this time because I had invited him, I had shown him many things. Join us as we learn about the men behind the legends. Adolf Gallen, Clash of Legends.